Alright, hey everyone, Wanbot here, and welcome back to Wasted. So I just stopped by the, um, the Gin and Gout, and I'll kind of explain how that works, uh, later. We're just gonna head to the cooler, I wanna go hit things. After the run, we'll stop at the Gin, gin and Gout, and I'll show you guys, uh, how it's, uh, how the Gin and Gout specifically works. But, uh, suffice to say, I think I've increased my hit by, like, a stupid amount. What's my hit right now? Nine. I'm a Hulkmeister General. Yeah, so I get, um, let's see, so bonus to damage dealt using melee and hand-to-hand -hand weapons, also, uh, fair amount armor and some stuff. Useful. I'm not entirely sure how that armor is gonna all factor in, but I'm looking forward to smacking things. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to understand how the Jin and Gout works, I'll explain it in a little bit, uh, but also there's a, there's a, uh, Steam discussion or a Steam guide that explains it all straight out much better than I ever could. Anyway, I do 20 damage. Uh, let's grab the DA Pistole. Goodbye, Rusty Pistol. Yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of, the, rid of the wasters anything. That stuff is garbage. Safety pants, and we got, we've got we also got the Wasteland workout gear. So it's gonna be a little bit harder for me to... Oh, goodbye, DA Pistole. Hello, Point Niner. Alternatively, yeah, it's about the same thing. Also grab the junk... Uh... We'll grab the junk food, though it's not as helpful for me anymore. Anyway, because of the way things are stacked up, I pretty much don't care about this at all. I just want to get to the end, see if I can- oh, you can explode people's faces. Okay, yeah, I want to get- I want to get to the end, I want to get, uh, that movement speed perk if I can get my hands on that. And I want to- I want to get to level 6. Luckily, I do a stupid amount of damage. And we'll do a ton of damage for pretty much the entirety of uh, today's episode, which I like. And I'm I'm gonna be able to. I guess I'm gonna be able to do this constantly. It kind of depends on the mixer of the day, but today specifically is just straight up big fisted. Uh, so I can just go around clobbering people. Own zone, you say? All right. Well, I did take a little bit more damage there there than usual. I guess let's just cram some mutamut guts in for the time being. I should probably pay attention to see if there's any, um, uh, unmarked flasks around, but whatever. So this is the right way. There we go. One-shotting people. Very satisfying, yeah, so I'm just trying to grab whatever I can. What's in here? Doozy. Uh, I guess we'll grab the doozy. Better than not. Let's see, buckshot. I'll start grabbing. I think I have a shotgun somewhere. Uh, that I can use on a future run. What is this? Oh, it's a sawed-off trap pointed the wrong direction. Alright, whatever, and this looks like it's the wrong way. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I could clobber my way through there, but that means the exit's not that direction. And I'm not really interested in sticking around or looting this place. It could be that way, but I'm more than willing... I'm more than willing to bet... that the place I'm going for is over here. Okay, nothing, nothing. I was kind of hoping I could get a meta stim off of one of these guys, but interestingly enough, they're usually only in lockers. Well, there was the meta stim. I guess I might as well take one of them. Uh, grab the rifle ammo. Don't remember if I put away the rifle from the last run. I think I died with it in my inventory. Oh well, not like I really care. Okay, cool. No dog, no dog. This time around, I'm not going to be... Uh, getting any explosives either. Or, no explosive hit thing. That could be really useful if I had a really, really strong gun. And, like, if I had a really strong gun, might work. Might not be a bad idea. But, I don't know. It's hard to say, really. Let's see. Yeah, nothing. Easy breathers. I guess let's go check out the lockers. I should get, get some more meta stims. Okay, there we go. Grab some buckshots. Don't know if they're gonna be useful, but I might as well collect ammo. That way, when I do have when I do have my inevitable actual using gun run, uh, we'll be able to use that to our advantage. Probably stay away from the explosive barrel that I just knocked over. Not entirely sure if that's going to blow up on my face, but at the same time, it's not the kind of thing I want to deal with. So let's let's hope we can get that speed upgrade. I'm really feeling sluggish now. To be fair, the knockback is kind of brutal, and I don't like dealing with that, but whatever. 
I just, I want to go fast, man. I gotta go fast. Uh oh. Squee? At what? It's still alive. Did not realize. Alright, whatever. Denim disaster piece, denim disaster piece. Junk food, but uh, food coma slowing me down is annoying. So let's not... Let's not go with that. I got enough metastims that I can more or less keep myself up at all times. Okay. Brave idiot. Is there anything in here? Eye patch. Shoot, hit, bullet spread. I'll take it. Extra hit stat is always useful. Okay, what do we even look like? Oh, right, I'm some random woman. Okay. That's not the right way. None of this is the right way. Then again. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not getting in there. Uh, I could. I could use all my can openers to get in. You know what? Let's do it. I do a ton of damage. And if it's got that level of can opening, that means there's probably something useful in here. Maybe. Did this guy? Oh, yeah. This person has a doozy on him. Let's see, green headband, nothing particularly useful. Safety pants, doozy, pe pistol ammo. Surprised that didn't blow up in my face when I went by on the first route through. Okay, and we get honestly nothing from here. Well, this is a waste of three can openers, but that's okay. I don't even know if I can save can openers, come to think of it. I've never seen a, uh, a specific place to deposit them. What? Okay, turns out jumping and attacking is probably a bad move in this game. Good to know. Never mind, don't want to go through there. Go this way. Grab that. Nothing from you. Meta stims, but can I not? Doesn't look like there's a way to specifically disable one of those. Kind of wish I could just cramp. I wonder if I could hit it with my crowbar. So you are. Hey, he's got a crowbar. What? Okay, let's drop off. What can I drop off? Junk food, medicine. Let's drop off the right rifle ammo. I might as well grab uh, an extra crowbar. And... <laughs> kind of incredible she didn't uh, get blown up here. Okay. Sadly, we're not really getting a whole lot of interesting things out of any of this. Buckshots, syringes... Oh, swole. Uh, can I fit it? No, right, because I don't have any... Weird. Apparently you can take multiple swoles. Didn't know. Alright, well, let's keep rushing for the end. The lack of movement speed is definitely... I'm gonna say a bit of a problem here. I'm very strong. Not seeing... Nope. I am hearing an enemy. Okay, and his face pasted. His face got pasted. I don't know. I'm not entirely, uh... I'm gonna say not entirely awake today. I had coke for one, so it's put me into kind of this, like, weird, I have energy, but I'm still really tired. Like, I can tell I need sleep, because I've got, you know, my eyes hurt. Uh... Whatever, this isn't the right way. I'm gonna stop messing with those. I wanna find the exit. I think this is it. Okay. Well, in that case, we can go back for that one. Let's drop off the crowbar. Just because. Yeah, these little rooms over here tend to be the ones with the, uh, the enemies, admittedly. But they also be to, uh, tend to be the ones with the, um, the flasks in them. And the occasional useful things. This game really does give you a lot of meta stims. Is that one? Nope. Nope. Okay, so let's go check. Let's see if, um, let's see if there's a booze. I guess there's no point checking for flasks if I'm gonna pick up a booze. Let's see if I can get the, uh, the speed boost. So, explosive sidecar? No. Bruce Brandy? Nope. Aimless Ale? Nope. And lastly, Slow Mojito? Also no. All of these are useless. On to level 6. Presumably. Hopefully my slow ass can survive the trip. I guess, uh, there's a higher chance of getting, um, Fanny packs down here. Let's see. Fuck. Sweet. 
Okay, sprayers are annoying. I don't mind the knockback in this game, but it is so hard to work with sometimes. Okay, this is probably altogether the wrong direction. Let's bonk it all open. Well, looks like we get at least a little bit of something or other. What's this? Unmarked flask, yes. Okay, reloads take longer. Well, it's life. Say no, let's do it over here. I noticed the character stands up a little bit when they drink, and I'd hate to get shot in the face as a result of it. Okay, ooh, I got regeneration. Uh, let's see, sweet shorts and horn dog vest? The answer is no. So there's nothing really worth anything in here beyond this grenade and a sawed off. Oh, I have been picking up buck shots, but I don't have too many. Is there anything? I guess I can drop off the uh, junk food. Let's grab the sawed off. Let's crouch underneath the uh, inevitable pain. And let's keep going with the uh, crowbar. Wait, what's a uh, buck and bronco? Pistol. Probably just got really high um, knockback. Okay, and can I bust this open? Okay, grab the TP, grab the ammo, there's nothing else in here. Let's start booking it. I've spent too much time in this section already, and we haven't even gone anywhere. Well, well, whatever, I regenerate HP. Retrospect, did not need to knock that thing around. Don't know entirely why I did, apart from because I can. Okay, somebody died over here. Ah. Wow. You know, all things considered, that was actually kind of convenient. Since I've got regenerating health, really wish regenerating skin was, uh... Actually, ooh. Really wish uh, regenerating skin was a thing I could get permanently. But it kind of makes sense why it, uh, why it isn't. I don't know. That would, that would be pretty, pretty ridiculous for runs if you just had uh, more or less constantly full health. Oh, well. Okay, at least we've picked up a fair amount of- oh, you're- you're a pun- you're of the punching variety. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna hide around the corner here. Yeah, it is. <sighs> Raider sprayers across the board. The problem is the doozies have really heavy na knockback, which feels really odd to me. Raider blaster tank and dork's vest. Well, the blaster tank... There's a bullet three, that's not super useful. Let's keep going. Kind of hoping for another medistim. I guess I'll just take my own. That way we can collect more, and it's all dork stuff past this point. HP is coming back. Not a whole lot to worry about, honestly. But still. Okay. Of course, there's always going to be somebody in here. Nothing useful. Baseball bat. Gas mask power pack. Blue baseball cap. Armor. Nothing beyond. Grab more buckshot. I do have a shotgun. Might use it, probably not going to. Stay away from the traps, stay away from there. And I'm not even I'm not even sure where the uh, exit's going to be. Unfortunately, once you hit the dormitories, it gets a little bit more maze-like. But I'm feeling pretty good about, wait, Raider Bruiser Jacket. We'll grab it if I see a Mojave Express, oh. Mojave Express, sorry. Uh, if I see a um, Oni Express, I'll drop it off. Okay, anything in here? Two buckshot. Yeah, I'm collecting ammo for that. I'll also drop off the buckshot and the... Uh... I'll drop off the, the buckshot and the whatever. Ooh, bum bag. And nothing else. Okay, well, that's fine. And there's the exit. Making good times. Okay, green headband, take a sneak. Nope, nothing useful. The other build I'd like to do at some point actually would be to go back with the uh, explosive sidecar or whatever it's called and like max up my blitz so I don't take any damage from explosions and I go around as Captain Explosion. But uh, it's not, that's not for today. Let's just keep trying to collect some of, some of the ammo. Oh, I see. The glass is supposed to reveal you. 
he doesn't have anything useful. Terminators. Shoot in a blit. Head armor. I'll take it. Oh, I want to stay away from that. I don't want to be near the explodey nonsense. Oh! Didn't realize there was a TP thing there. I guess I'll check that the next time I go through a, uh... The next time I go through bathrooms. Probably a good idea. Don't really feel like dealing with things. Okay, uh, let's go into inventory. Mark Crowbar is one, Doozy is two, Sawed Off is as three. There we go, that way we can actually switch back and forth here. I'm just not gonna touch that room. It seems like more work than it's worth. Across the board. Are they fighting each other? Oh, I see. Yeah, I probably can just hit them in the face with a crowbar, honestly. Ow! That glass was much more damaging than I'm used to. Business stop, dork slacks, business stop. Ah, can opener. Useful. Okay. Anything in here? Not a clue. Actually, this is exactly what I was looking for. So, let's drop off the bruiser jacket, the... Terminators, the sawed-off, even though I'm using it here, I'll just use the doozy. I don't get a whole lot of sawed-off, so this seems like a good idea. And we're good to go. Okay, awesome. We'll drop that off. Kind of wish I could drop off my TP, too, but... You know, honestly, they'd probably steal it, given the theme of this game. Oh, somebody, somebody hit that one. Grenade. Don't know if I'm going to use the grenades... But, at the same time... Might as well. Okay, so he's not gonna blow up. Oh, swole. Take it. Okay, business top, pistol ammo. Right. I really do need to keep going faster here. Spending too much time doing exploration. Okay, there we go. Nothing particularly useful. Seriously? Oh. Apparently I've been maxed on, uh, pistol ammo all this time. And cooler armor is tempting, but not that tempting. Okay, let's keep going. Because, yeah, I'm here- I'm here for the booze. Here to get what I can. Let's grab the buck shots. Red baseball cap, note, rifle ammo, note, and... Take yet more swole. Yeah, that actually really doesn't hurt. It just kind of knocks you around. Makes life a little bit easier. As long as you don't stand in the goop afterwards. Okay, nothing useful. Stay away from the jackrabbiting, uh... Explosive. Hey! And we've made it. What is this thing? Oh, it's just a jukebox. It's like a cafeteria. Oh, right! I have been in here. Well, whatever. Plant people porter. Tiny bit of health regeneration. No? That could be amazing. Inspector Tequila Sunrise. On more rounds of pistol ammo per stack. Not bad. Not very useful for me. Knockout IPA. Uh, knocks enemies back more. And Shell Shock. Shotgun Blasts have more knockback. Well, I guess plant people. Uh, Porter it is. So this gives me a little bit of HP regen. Not much, and honestly, I'm probably just going to be relying on other stuff. That said, it's still a nice bonus. And we can go back with all of our loot. And sort, sort what we need. So let's drop off the doozy. I'm just going to keep collecting doozies in here. Uh, let's see. Anything else? Not really. Trip and hazard I'll just drop off. I think I can just store as much as I want in the stash. Though eventually I'm going to have to organize better. Oh yeah. Let's drop off the pistol ammo because I'm not using it. Okay. Also, uh, deposit everything but... Uh, let's deposit everything but 30 TP. We're going to stop by the Oni Express. Well, this worked out great. And, yeah, I have to do this every single time we come back. Oh, wow. That was a 20-minute run. Well, let's honestly hope that um, the next run goes by a little bit faster. Just because um, I want to get the speed bonus. 
I'm a little bit on the slow side. Oh, I think this is the first time I've ever been to the Oni Express at nighttime. Neat. Welcome to the Shut show. up. Uh, let's see. Wait. So, uh, let's explain how this works. So, Champagne gives you a 20% damage bonus. Tough Kila gives you a 20%, uh, not 20%, 15 and 15. 15% damage bonus and then 15% defense. So, let's go Champagne. Uh, so, there's Soda, which, what's Soda do? Soda, oh, right, Soda, soda changes it so you get 10% to one and 5% to the other. It's not bad. Uh, you get Straight, which is just the maximum effect. Or you get the Mixer of the Day, which... Adds on to the effect. So in this case, so it would be a uh, big fisted. Okay, now we've got on the rocks as a shot, shaken, stirred, and blended. On the rocks is plus two a blit. As a shot is plus two shot. Shaken is plus two hit. Stirred plus two tinker. Blended plus two sneak. And there's a secret one. Um, is I guess you have to get multiple drinks or something. There's a secret one called Cannibal Style, which gives plus one all stats. However, for me, I'm a uh, I'm a melee person, we're going shaken. And this gives me a nice little bonus to our stats. And we can do this every single time we go on a run. Okay. So I am shitting bricks. And does this put my stats what I think it is? <laughs> Muscle bound grotesque. That's great. Guess I picked up some more um some more strength while I was down there. But yeah, ideally. Uh, we can just loop this a bunch of times, get my stats up, get some good gear, and then eventually get to, I assume there's another type of cooler later on in the game. I have no idea. I haven't really touched it too much, but, you know, feels good. Now, I really like this game. At first, I was, like, super cranky about it, and I'm kind of getting into it. I still wish that there was... Okay. I kind of wish there was a little bit that I could carry with me, if that makes sense. Let's grab the point niner. I'm not even going to bother. I wonder what my uh, health regen is. It's got to be incredibly slow if I'm not gaining any here. Well, that's okay. Yeah, it's super slow. So I can get multiple levels of it. Do these guys never have to reload? I think they do. It's just not very often. Well, whatever. It's not like I'm too worried here. I've got a bunch of meta stims that I can throw on. I'm just being lazy up until about 50 HP. But yeah, here's hoping we can come across that speed boost. Booze along. Jesus! How many people were just crammed in here? The answer is everyone. Seriously. Oh, pooping pills. Oh. Okay, yeah, next time I've got that thing that gives me the, uh, the bonus. Oh, really? I'm already maxed on pistol ammo. That is kind of insane. Uh, next time I've got that, that bonus, the fat-ass booze buff, where I get a damage bonus while I'm running a food coma, uh, I need to absolutely make sure that I don't take pooping pills. I was just taking it by, by default, but it turns out, not always a good idea. Easy enough. Okay. Interesting. Did I kill that one? Fuck. I don't I don't even know what's going on here. Okay, there we go. Get away from the dog. Yeah, for whatever reason I couldn't hit that dog. Don't know why. Very frustrating. Okay, Metastim will take it. Sweet and shorts. Actually, sweet and shorts, any good? Nope, shoot and sneak. Alright, and this time we grab the toilet paper dispenser. Though I will admit, I don't really have a whole lot of need for a TP from what I've seen. Yeah, I want to start stacking up on revolver ammo. Balls. There should be like combat boots or something that make it so you're not susceptible to those. Ooga what? Okay. I'm mostly just looting these guys for the chance of getting some equipment here. Oh. Either I stepped on a, um... Yeah, let's go in my inventory. Either I stepped on a cinder block or she was carrying it with her. One way or another, that hurt really bad. Okay, slam out, straps. 
I'm gonna pick up a little bit uh, refill on the meta stims, but honestly, it's not a huge rush. Okay. Huh. And obviously, if I'm starting to look really worse for the wear, then we can just leave. Be kind of nice if you could just leave at any time. But I guess that doesn't make a lot of sense. Also, I just noticed that there looks to be some kind of fanny pack that you can wear on your head. Uh, let's see. Might as well grab this. Welcome to the Welcome to the, welcome to the what? Sorry, I didn't catch that. <sighs> okay. Really gotta watch out for the bear traps. Unfortunately, this game is dark as shit. And I... I don't exactly appreciate that. That guy was winding up. I probably don't need to grab another, um... I probably don't need to grab any more crowbars. Ooh, booze. Slow mojito. Hell no. Slow mojito, more like no mojito. Okay. Let's go this way. I wonder if there's multiple, uh, staircases down. It's possible. Inaccessible. Doesn't look like there's anything here. Well, that's fine. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I've, I've heard a lot of people discussing about the... Can I just hit this? Oh, I can just hit them. Okay, I've heard a lot of people discussing how, um... How this game's, like, stealth system works and stuff like that. And I just, like, it doesn't... It doesn't appeal to me in, like, any way, shape, or form. I just enjoy just running through and smacking things to all, all get out. I don't know, it's way more enjoyable to me. I do kind of wish there was, like, you know, actually I would say this would be kind of fun if it had like a Fallout style leveling system. Uh, just because. Uh, I, I feel like kind of a, an equipable... How'd you not die? Oh, he almost, he was almost dead to begin with. Let's stay away from that landmine. Um. But, you know, kind of, uh, uh, beyond just the mutations. It'd be kind of nice. Maybe? I don't know. I guess, like, okay, this is gonna come off as, like, super, I'm gonna say controversial, just because a lot of people hate them. But, like, I actually really like the idea of, wait, what's Blue Ox do? Oh, hey. Plus three speed for, that's actually very substantial. Bucking Bronco, pistol, point niner, also pistol. Okay. Metastim can't do anything with it. And ah, I see why this. Ow. Do we have anything to drop off? Yeah, we do. We got buckshots to drop off and revolver ammo to drop off. There we go. Don't have anything else. What's this? Brass knuckles, trip and hazard. Okay, slow mojitive. Me weakness. Nope, none of these are good. Guess we're gonna not. We're going on to uh, level six. That's fine. But I actually really like the idea of, um, like, you know, Skyrim and Fallout's, like, kind of randomized levels, as shitty as that sounds. Uh, like, a lot of people hated them, and I agree. I thought they were kind of boring from the perspective of, like, a Fallout game, because it's not, it's not very fun playing, you know, a game that's supposed to be, um, you know, it's not very fun playing a game where you're supposed to be. Uh, going through like really well designed levels and like fighting things and whatnot But for me, I could totally see like almost that kind of thing being applied to a, a roguelike in a really really fun manner um, Just because I I don't know. I'm not entirely sure if I like the I'm not entirely sure if I enjoy the uh, okay, Let's wait for this guy to come around the corner. There we go. Um so we We're maxed on pistol ammo. I guess I could have Drop some off. Hello. Let's get a random buzz. We got lucky last time. What do we get this time around? Hey! Less damage from bear traps. It seems kind of appropriate. I, I'm realizing that it actually... It actually does generate these rooms as you open the door. Which is interesting. Only these rooms, but still. Blue Ox is super nice. For the, for the speed. I'm not entirely... Oh. It's like supposed to be kind of a Sonic reference, maybe. Don't know. But uh, I would totally enjoy, like, if you took more or less Fallout combat and applied this game's, like, level design to it. Oh. 
Alrighty then. Oh, I got that. Nice. Okay, let's quick take a look, see what's inside there. I've lost my speed buff, which is a shame because I liked it. Okay, what do we got in here? This had like multiple lock things in relation in relation to it, which is usually a good sign. Can I equip that? No. Okay. Oh, I see. I'll just drop them off for the time being. Okay, see so these guys were defending almost nothing. What was the point then? Don't know. Let's go under that. I don't want to spend too much time going down uh going down these avenues, so I think I'm just gonna head keep heading for the exit. I'll bother with exploration when I know for a fact I can kill what's its. Uh the son of a bitch. Oh, I'm not done yet. There we go. Uh just don't land in the poison. Okay, anything here? No, this one's locked. Can I just bust it open? I can. What? Oh. I was like, where's the, uh, where's the alarm coming from? There's our answer. Okay. Yeah, if I was... If I didn't already fill the, uh, Oni Express with a bunch of loot, I'd actually start filling it with fanny packs. Might start doing that in the future. Okay, got lucky on that one. Oh. Somebody had a cinder block there. Glad I didn't get hit by it. Okay, nothing particularly useful here. Bum bag. I think I already have a bum bag. Bum bag, nothing. Okay, well that's fine. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I think it would just be kind of interesting having, like, actually, like, an infinite dungeon in a Skyrim game. Obviously, like, you ha you'd have to have some level of design for that sort of thing. Just to keep it interesting, but, uh, don't know. Okay, it's a fanny pack, I already got that. That's the... That's the radio going. I was worried that I was hearing somebody talking to me, and I was like, I don't want this. Okay, so that's it. Oh, just one of you. Oh, there's some kind of booze in here. Guzzle grit. Negates the speed penalty of food coma. Oh, yes! Absolutely! Uh, so, speed penalty... Uh, reduction on... Or... Negates the speed penalty of food coma and increases hit by three when infected by one. Huh, and we won't have to have pooping pills while we do this. And this provides a great end cap for this episode. So we've already gotten back more or less to where we were. Obviously we have one benefit and it's slightly different. Let's drop off. Let's drop off everything but 30 TP as per our usual. Let's see, what else do we have? Uh, let's just drop it off in the stash. Rifle ammo. I'll keep the point .9er with me, it's not very good. Drop off the swole. Let me drop off the liquid bread. A lot of this stuff that, you know, I don't need to keep with me because I get more of. Buckshots, grenade. There we go. Okay, I guess what I could also do is... Let's see. I could, I could drop off my fanny packs. Let's do that. I'm not going to need them. Hell, I'm not even sure if I'm going to need them in the future. Okay, well, let's go back. Let's grab the stuff from the Oni Express, too. And then let's keep going. Okay. Oh, my inventory is full. Well, this is fine. Okay, well, I guess I might as well say goodbye for now. So, I'll see you guys on the next episode of Wasted. And as always, thanks for watching.